chance to do that again so they have today the against the Red Sox. We'll take one more break Boston and bring you back to the, the Rutgers Center. Go. Two on the hill against Victoria, B.C.'s Nick Pavetta. Day afternoon, the Blue Jays trying to complete a sweep of the Boston Red Sox, put another W on the board. And he's pitched pretty well as he is under three during those first eight starts. He has not faced the... The Trump. But first... It's the Red Sox. Rafaela not in the starting lineup yesterday for the minute. It was Rafaela in center when the Dalton Varsho line drive went over his head way to win the game. A slower curveball and also agreeing with the home plate umpire, but that's the home plate umpire's call. And, he and now one to right field and he dies. He's been terrific all season long. Third, where he's been recently, uh, he's providing a lot of value for this team. The last game. in last night's game, yesterday's game in the ninth inning, got a base hit to start it. So here's Rob Ref Schneider again, briefly a Blue Jay back in 26. And a swing and a miss. Ryu gets him two down. Fielder Kevin Bishu, as we mentioned, making his 22nd to start in right. Matt Shaft, straight start catching Ryu. Third ball for a strike to just has gone three for ten with a couple of doubles so far. It is popped up back of the plate, but change up foul back. He's smiling it. Back and forth, and we've seen this. Even now, as he gets more innings, the velocity is starting to spike a little bit. Not on the curveball, and that seems that awaits his turn. Left, it is playable. Far show is there in order. See him a lot. Victoria BC's Nick Pavetta on the mound for the yeah. Red Sox. They do the ball well, and now he's back in the rotation. Better numbers out of the bullpen than on Nick Pavetta, one of a few Blue Jays who have numbers on him. He's tough. It's going to stay in the ballpark for Ref Snyder, who makes the fence. Is Ref Snyder, Rafaela, and Adam Duval, who started in the left field yesterday, never for second time in this series. Jet swings at the first pitch, and this will be already quickly two down. The bullpen got things turned around for him. So two down, and here's Guns. And they need all the power that he has. Now 24 on the season. Pop this one up on the right side of the infield, and it'll be. Club in baseball. And you know what? When you're not hitting much and gotten that, and you need good defense, and they have certainly gotten that. Here's a run a home run in yesterday's game. Those were the only two runs Chris Bassett. Well, when he hit that home run also, he had a Dominican-born player. Before turning 27, they all a little bit high in a full count, and a ground ball to the left side. Long run, Bichette. Long throw. 249, 19 homers, and a couple of career home runs. They did not play on Friday night. This afternoon. It's the left field corner, and that's a fair. We'll stop at third, and that's a dumping practice, but nobody hit on the field. Who in limited in bats is hitting 302 on the season. That double for as you saw, Schneider simply looked up at the heavens and laughed. Through some sometimes the liners get caught. Some people believe the plan. A roller to short, backhanded by City did it the first time we really saw where they stayed strictly away from him, and it is to make adjustments in the big leagues. Now Kevin Biggio playing right. Got two plate appearances in yesterday's pinch hitter for Matt Chapman. And came up with a base hit, and then he walked in the ladder to make, given you know, Chapman's a veteran guy who's had a lot of success, but on September... I don't think any player should be surprised by what John Snyder does. You think about it last time. He's been consistent with everything he's done. The manager has to make this difficult decisions. And that ground ball is out at second. Biggio hitting in the sixth spot today. Chapman again just off the I.L. a few days in order to hear in the moment. 
Chapman. And you know what? Chapman's. Oh. That's high, and it's two balls and a strike. Hit hard, but way foul down the left field line. Ball inside the bag, and Vigio's in for Kevin Kiermeyer. Throw down to third, Vigio back in. Two and one now on Kiermeyer. Here today. It will be caught on the track. Both runners are going to tap. Who had the triple in the ninth inning? We think it, I think we both agree on this. More emotion. Yeah, he kept his emotions in check most of the season. Strike three call. Remain in the regular season. Two teams, 12 games. Yeah, lifetime ago. And both teams are dramatically different in their personnel. Out. And wouldn't the Yankees, who are at the moment six games playing. Cabrera, Peraza, they're playing. Volpe's had a great year. Oh, the Cy Young frontrunner. As Reese McGuire lines one into center for a base hit. Yeah, the. Hit a fly ball to right in the first inning. That was a nice diving. A few more changeups away. That is the third base umpire. Oh, it's second and third. Nobody out for the Red Sox. And the Blue Jays will play it the same way. Kind of in on the. You know, with Reese McGuire at third base, catcher Jays. Varsho is in, makes the catch, and McGuire not good. Ground ball to third. Chapman's got it. McGuire back to third, and Chapman's now. And the batter is Devers. Now, I know Devers is a lefty in Good trip to the mound right here. I mentioned Heinemann is catching Ryu for the third straight start, so. There's a called strike, two and a. Is called high ball three. And that's high ball four. Devers will walk. The plate too much. And strike one. Fouled off 0 oh and 2. Got a piece of it on a ball down and ace. As he tries to strand all these runners. Biggio fighting the sun, but seems to have it. And a jam for the second inning in a row.